Hello? Hello? What is up, guys? Parking Lot Panda, back at you for another reaction video. Um, I'm really going to need y'all to let me know whenever bands like Sleep Token drop new music, especially when <laughs> they're dropping it kind of out of the blue. Um, I didn't see this. Uh, if you've watched the Will Ramos uh, Sleep Token cover, that should be out before I upload this. No promises. You'll know that I am a big fan of Sleep Token. I've seen them live a few times with uh, In This Moment. Um, in This Moment's probably one of my favorite bands to see live. Uh, they put on an awesome show. Uh, and yet, yeah, Sleep Token does not slouch. <laughs> they definitely rise to the occasion of performing with a band like In This Moment. Um, that being said, I saw this come across my playlist. Sleep Token, The Summoning. It's got 2 million views out just a month ago. So clearly this has to be something big. I have watched, I believe, uh, actually, I don't know if I've even seen Chokehold yet either. That might be another one that I'll check out. Um, yeah, I'm really excited to see what this is. Uh, Sleep Token has always been a band that's kind of impressed me. And yeah, it's long intros. Let's get into this. Okay, right off the bat, there is some serious tool influence in this. Man, the crazy kind of uh, just off rhythms that are happening with the drums and the bass. And then you've got Vessel's vo uh, vocals over top of it. And I've always uh, really liked uh, Vessel's way of singing. That is his name. Yeah, Vessel. That's what he goes by. I'm pretty sure. Um I, I have always been deeply impressed by this group, um, and it seems like they are not going to be stopping that trend anytime soon. It's also good to see them getting some recognition. Two million views on a video that's been out a month? Heck yeah. Finally getting some recognition these guys deserve. Uh, yeah, a lot of Tool influence, a lot of Pink Floyd influence. This is really good so far. Oof. Oh, wow. I just got full on, uh, you're not going to this full on goosebumps, dude. That was impressive. Uh, Again, I've seen these guys live, so I know he can sing, but holy crap, dude. This is, yeah. Okay. Okay. Six minute song. Stop pausing. Come on. <sighs> this is going to be dope. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Where'd this come from? You've got my party, flesh and bone. 
Oh, that chug. Wow. The visuals are also really cool, right? I just got full on chills, dude. Just all the way down. Wow, dude. Okay. Yeah, they're making an impact. These uh this group's gonna be, I think, a huge, huge group in the very, very near future. Um, so talk about that back in a little bit in the track. That transition into like the heavy stuff. I being a periphery guy, I hear a lot of periphery in that. And it's really awesome to see these new groups that have come up with all these different genres that are just blending. And I, you know, it's, you see it a lot in the falling in reverse track that I did where it's just genres are being blended and the kind of the set defined, uh, what a song has to be to fit into a genre. I feel like that's going away and I could not be happier about that. I'm one of those people that I think that genres are just dumb. <laughs> they're, they're a good labeling system if you want to try to find a specific sound. But for the most part, they just hinder progress. And it's really, really, really cool to finally see some progress in music. Uh, if anybody tells you that today's music sucks, show them guys like Sleep Token and guys like Falling in Reverse. Because, yeah, it there could not be a better time to be a music nerd because this is some awesome stuff. Some awesome stuff. A little bit of a ranty rant, but it's something, yeah, I feel passionately about that. Let's get back into it. Oh, that syncopation is so good. We're going back into the heavy part again. Oh, oh. What? Oh, now we're in like some Pink Floyd stuff. Oh, and they got a really cool pan on the audio and the headphones. Oh, I got goosebumps again. I gotta stop for a second. Holy cow, guy. Wow. All that just, you guys watch my videos, you know that I'm a big fan of anything EDM and just the kind of the trance feel that's going on in my headphones right now. If you haven't listened to the song on headphones, you need to listen to this song in a good set of headphones because they've got different parts of it kind of bouncing back and forth. It's kind of giving it that binaural effect. Uh, man. Just gotta whew, bring myself back down a little bit. Come on. 
you're doing a reaction video, you can't fall into a freaking trance. All right, let's go. These guys. Also, he looks like a character straight out of Elden Ring, right? Hello? Hello? God. What just happened? What just happened? Did I mistake you for Oh my god. I'm speechless. I, I, oh my God, who does that song? Uh, no rest for the wicked. Isn't it the heavy or is it a uh, cage? The elephant. Oh my God, dude. Uh, I was talking about genre blending earlier. <laughs> wow. Uh, if you guys have watched my periphery reaction to wildfire, uh, go watch that video. It's one of my favorite ones that I recorded. Um, You'll know that I'm a big jazz guy. I'm going to rewind and do this whole part again, and I don't even care. Uh, this is cool. It's funky. The bass, his vocals, they need to do more stuff like this because they could corner the market on this stuff, man. Just what? Did I miss How did I miss this? That drummer knows what he's doing too. He's played stuff like this before. I want to pause it, but I can't. Oh, man, I could have a dude. You could make a whole album sound just like that. You would not get a complaint out of me. There's so much soul in his voice. Man, I, I, have, I still have, I have like total goosebumps and they won't go away. This album is going to be awesome. And again, I said it in the video, I'll say it again. These guys are going to define this genre in the next few years. I have a very good feeling that bands like this and Polyphia are, you know, they're just, they're, they're pushing the envelope of what's possible. Um, 
and the genre blending for falling in reverse and the polyphia does it too they like to blend uh rap and hip-hop into a lot of their stuff even though they don't have lyrics but a couple of their songs have lyrics um yeah this is really really good stuff and it's not like genre blending is new rock and hip-hop have been intertwined since the 90s i mean it probably even before that you know that's that's something that's been happening for a long time uh but now that you have avenues like spotify and youtube it's uh, a lot easier to get that stuff out you don't have to play to what the radio wants to hear people can actually go and search for the type of stuff they want this is dope this is dope what else can i say about this uh sleep token y'all are awesome um and i cannot wait to see what you guys do in the future uh you guys have a very 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 good follower in me um and I can't wait to see you guys live again. I want to see this song live. Dude, I want to see how the crowd reacts to this song live. Yeah. Let me get out of here. I could rant all day. If you liked it, please do. Subscribe if I've earned it. Slap it with a Elden Ring character. And uh, yeah. Y'all have a good one. Peace. Peace.